are joined from Dubai by Aaron Leslie Jones, uh, Chief uh, Research Analyst at uh, Century Financial. This uh, or these uh, sh quick shifts or changes by Elon Musk. If you are following Elon Musk on Twitter, you read the first uh, tweet and then suddenly we see another controversial one more than the first. Uh, we have seen this trend happening for the last few weeks, especially when it was announced finally that the deal will go through. So if this pressure on Twitter were to continue and if there is a retaliation to what Musk is doing, do you think this could be the beginning of the end of Twitter? Uh, first of all, uh, Elon Musk and controversy, I mean, it's not about last few weeks, it's for, I mean, for a very long period of time, years and years, um, whether with regard to Tesla or news with regard to Tesla, Elon Musk has always skirted uh, controversy. Now, um, so even though uh, Elon Musk at many times might seem like uh, out of touch or like a controversial striking the uh, bad notes, but uh, let us not forget that Elon Musk is actually a genius. I mean, he has created some amazing enterprises uh, during the course of his professional life, whether it's Tesla, whether it is uh, SpaceX, whether it is Starlink or even the PayPal, um, the beginning. Uh, so uh, he not only created great enterprises, he makes them profitable also. So regarding Twitter, I think, um, I don't think it's the beginning of the end of Twitter. I don't uh, see it like that. Uh, Twitter was stagnant for a long period of time. So, so I mean, uh, uh, to be fair to uh, Elon Musk, I think he's trying his best to uh, make it more pro uh, profitable, more relevant in the current uh, social media era. Uh, obviously, having said that, I mean, it's like a break or make or break scenario for Twitter. Uh, let's see how it goes forward from here. So if there is a decline in the revenues from ads, some companies announced that they will stop or suspend ads or they might take a position against Musk or they might pull their ads from the platform. If there was a decline in this, these revenues, this could uh, put more ad or additional pressure on the profits of the company. Uh, Mr. Uh, Leslie. For sure, I mean, sure. Um, if uh, if uh, this uh, if Elon Musk wants to uh, go on with his decisions uh, and the ideas he has in his head and mind, do you think uh, we can see uh, a buyback of the shares uh, uh, to delist the company from the stock exchange? Do you think this could be put on the table now? Yeah, delisting of shares always on the table. Again, uh, coming back to the uh, report of advertisers actually pulling out of uh, Twitter. I mean, um, uh, there have been a lot of concern about moderation of content, not only really in Twitter, but in all the major social media platforms. Now, whether the advertisers would in reality pull out the dollars from uh, away from Twitter and deploy into other uh, advertisements also depends upon um, how many users Twitter are able to generate per new uh, per year? Uh, how many? Uh, what is the reach of their um, uh, audience? What is the mon monetization probability of their content? So a lot of other factors are uh, uh, ultimately important. I mean, advertisers might move away for the time being. Let us not forget that uh, last year. I mean, I mean, I think one one and a half years back, uh, Facebook also faced a similar issue. I mean. Uh, like uh, they had an issue, uh, like a lot of major advertisers pulled out uh, the advertisement dollars like shift the advertisement budget away from Facebook but ultimately what happened all these people who uh, left Facebook or stayed away from Facebook again came back to Facebook primarily because they could not uh, see that kind of audience elsewhere so it, it is able to prove that it has actually a genuine uh, generally it's able to prove that that if number of users are growing, it is having more relevant content, then I think even the advertisers will not be have any option rather than coming back to uh, Twitter. Uh, again, I would like to just talk uh, from... Okay, Mr. Uh, Aaron, uh, Leslie John, in terms of the return to Facebook, yes, part of them are back, as you said, but things are not back to as it used to be. 
before those uh, campaigns by advertisers for different reasons, which was clearly during uh, the meta uh, guidance for the uh, future Facebook profits. In any case, we are so grateful for your contribution today. You are, uh, you have joined us from Century Financial, Chief Market Analyst. Have a nice day. Sure. Thank thanks. you. Same to you, Kam.